back to Mrs. Action Molly. What to do? Welcome back to another tutorial. Today we're going to be learning how to create a Hexa server to play with all your friends. So, first thing you want to do is you want to create a brand spanking new folder on your desktop. Just name it anything. I'm just going to title mine Hexa Server. Uh, and just drag that anywhere you want. I'm just going to drag it right here. Now you're going to need two things. You're going to need the server itself, so, and then you're also going to need Hamachi, but I already have it downloaded, so just. Make sure that this little box is clicked and click download now and save it to your desktop and then install it. So now what you want to do is you want to go to you want to go to this website technopack.net. I'll put it in the description. You want to go to mod packs and then you want to click on Hexit. Wait for it to load. Go to click download and then go to server files. And then it'll say server owners can get the latest server files here and make and the version currently right now that, that is, the time of uploading this is um. Uh, 1.0.10. Just click that and save it to your desktop. Just give it a couple seconds. I swear to God, I'm gonna murder this thing. Okay, so as you can see, there's a couple seconds remaining. And then in the meantime, if you haven't downloaded Hamachi, just download it now. Just you know, make sure the conditions of use is checked and click download and you know, save it to your desktop. So uh, uh yeah. Anyway, I'll get back to you when it's uh, fully, you know, downloaded. Alright, now when that is done, you want to open it up with, uh, like, anything that you have, like WinRAR or something. I highly suggest you get WinRAR. Now you want to open up your Hexa server folder and drag all the contents from here into your Hexa server folder. Just give it a couple seconds and, uh, depending on how fast your internet is or the room you're in, this should load up in no time. So yeah, now what you want to do is double click launch it's a it's a batch file if you're doing this on windows and basically this is the normal hexa server it's going to load up everything and if you notice over here uh if you you know if you haven't already you know it's loading everything so i'm actually going to minimize this because i haven't installed hamachi yet and so if you haven't installed hamachi just make sure it's you know double clicked click run you know choose your preferred language click next Next, I agree, and then install. And then it should show some status. You know, it, it's gonna take a while, but um. Anyway, uh, as you can see, it, it's preparing the spawn area. Eh, you get the point. Anyway, uh, uh, I'll get back to you guys when everything is fully loaded. If this pops up, just click yes. So uh, yeah. Alright, so once that's done, you should see all these files in here, and then you should see this. Uh, the log man Hamachi setup is complete. Just make sure that this box is checked and click, then click finish. So uh, now it's loading up. Click this little button that says power, that, uh, you know, like a little power button. Just click it. You know, just click create. Whatnot. So, um, once that's perfect, I can show you all the files in here. Whitelist is basically all the players that you want on your server and don't want. So, like, I can put in my name. So, and then it'll. And then you want to click save. Do that for ops because you do not want to have to have to shut down your server and do it all over again. So, you just want to type in your Minecraft username. So, you know, save it. Uh, this is basically banned IPs, whatever IPs you do not like want on here. Uh, you know, banned players, and whatnot. Now you want to go to server properties or just server. You know, it's a properties file. Double click that. Um, uh, you know, this is where you can like change all the settings. You know, from what you want, like you know, uh, the level seeds, spot animals. You know, you get the point. But I want only three people on my server, so the max players is only going to be three. MOTD stands for message of the day, so you can like title it like. I don't really give a Hashtag the end of the rainbow if it's being on a billboard I from the moment as a cover to the or something. So you can tell it's hat, uh, and then you want to click save after you're done editing it or whatever. Close it. Um, so yeah, now that Hamachi is done, you want it is mandatory that you click create a new network. Now, this is basically the network that your server is going to be running off of. So just uh, what you want to do is the network ID is going to be the name of your network and the uh, uh, password is um, basically the password of your network. Now, I will actually delete this network after I'm done because I don't want anyone in to get on the server. 
I mean, I might make a public like Hexa server, but you guys are you guys can decide that. Make it a make, leave a comment down below. So yeah, I'll get back to you guys when it's all done. So um, once that done, once that's done, you wanna you wanna right click on the IP and then you wanna click I, copy IPv4 address. Open up server properties again. Scroll down to you see uh, server IP and just paste it in there. Oh crap. Anyway, uh, let me try this again. So yeah, you want to paste it in here and then click save. This is basically the, the network that your server is going to be running off of. And if your friends want to join, obviously they have to download and install Hamachi. And then click join an existing network, you know, give them the username and then the password and then they'll click join and then they'll be with you so they can join the server as well. Anyway, um, now the mods, you know, this is where every, this is all the Hexet mods. And, um, you know, the... I don't even know what this is. The world is basically the world that you're, that you're gonna spawn in. So let's uh, now you want to double click launch again. You know, just click run. You know, it's gonna load up everything and whatnot. And um, uh, now you also want to start up your Technic launcher because this Technic is basically where um, Hexit is located. So yeah, you can also download that too. You know, put in my username. You know, I'm gonna make sure it remembers me because it keeps logging me out for some weird reason. And once that's done, you wanna make sure that this is Hexit. This is basically a picture for Hexit. Click play. You know, it's gonna load up all these things, and then you know, your server's still gonna be running, still gonna be loading everything, whatnot. So yeah, uh, I'll get back to you guys once everything is done loading for me. Now that everything is loaded up, your server is loaded up, uh, for, I think it's for, like, the main guy who's hosting his server, like, you can either do, like, a go to direct connect and type in local host or something, then maybe it'll... If I'm looking at tomorrow, check but I don't know, it doesn't work like that. But you want to go to add server and then add that same IP address, you know, that one. And then, um, you want to click join server and then log in. And, um, wait for it to be logging in. And, um, get ready for it. Get ready for it. See, that's logging in. And um, as you can see, uh, this is where I spawn. So yeah, um, guys, this is how you set up a Hexa server. If you enjoyed this video, please slap that like button. Let's try and break that like barrier of two likes. And if you want to see more tutorials, please slap that favorite button. And also, um, yeah, bye.